Today I would like to show you my uh, leek plants, my hydroponic leek. Um, I am growing them with a Kratky system, um, version 1 and version 2. This is version 1. As you can see, very simple setup, bucket, cups and plant. And that's it. I have algae formation. Uh, this doesn't really worry me. Uh, the cause is simply because of the uh, transparency of the lid, which is white and lets uh, uh, light go through. Uh, but uh, until the LG uh, growth is limited to a certain amount, uh, it will it will not really compete with the plants and it will not uh, be uh, such a big issue. If you remember the basil, um, I was growing the basil in two buckets, a black bucket and a white bucket. In this case, I don't have the white bucket just because I finished them. But anyway, even if this bucket is under the sun, because this is uh, exposed directly to the south of my garden, so even if this is completely under the sun, and even if it is black, it is not really suffering. As you can see, the leak is doing well. I prefer version number two, which is always a Kratky system, but I protected it against uh, the heat of the sun. As you can see, the roots are perfectly, perfectly white, and there is no algae formation. Okay, now let's check how I made the system. The system is very easy. I bought a 45 liter uh, container. I think it's a 10 gallon, 12 gallon container. Very important. I have to say that it is food grade container. I painted black at the outside and I made this little wooden frame. This little wooden frame um, is fixed at the top of the container and the reason why I made this wooden, con uh, wooden frame it is because after filling uh, the container with uh, water uh, it, loses, it, uh, it bends, the wall bends and uh, since I think this is a problem, I mean, uh, it is a problem because when you have to put the lid on top of the container, you want a rectangular shape container. You don't want uh, walls that are bent because then you uh, have difficulty in uh, covering the whole of the container. Therefore, I put this frame and next step, I took some panda film, white outside, black inside, and I wrapped all the system. Here it is. So simple as that. Oh, I forgot. That's it. I would like to let you notice that the polyethylene uh, film arrives at the top of the plateau. I am using plastic cups. I made by myself all those holes. I didn't drill them, but I used a 10 millimeter drill bit. I overheated it and then I uh, pinched all those holes into the cups. 
a friend of mine asked me uh, why I put this condom on the on the on the leak, and well, actually, uh, this is my first time I'm growing leeks, but I saw on the internet many 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 people uh, just putting uh, those cylinders uh, uh, onto the leak, and um, the reason therefore should be so that I. Uh, let's say I develop a longer a longer uh, a longer body of the leak okay since uh, there is no light inside there is no light coming inside and since the leaves will de develop uh, only starting from this point and above I checked the pH and the conductivity of the leaks uh, just before doing this video, the micro siemens were approximately 1800. I started about two months ago with uh, a value of 2200, uh, so they really consumed uh, very little, as little as 400 micro siemens per centimeter, and uh, this is normal because this is not such a demanding crop. On the contrary, the pH is fairly high because uh, it was 9.2. I think this is due to the fact that the, that the garden is an outside garden, outdoor garden. Therefore, any time it rains, like tonight, uh, the rain will go into the bucket, into the container, and it will rise the, 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 the level of the pH. Anyway, even if it is 9.2, this is the effect. I suggest everybody who wants to uh, do hydroponics, so to every beginner I suggest to use a Kratky system, since the Kratky system is really easy, easy to build, easy to set up, easy to uh, work with. In this case, after building the container and after building the, the, the system, which I will be reusing in the coming years, well, after uh, building the, the, the system, I just poured in the solution and then for two and a half months I didn't do anything. And this is the result. So keep it simple and let all the plant work by themselves. I wish you a good day and, of course, happy growing. Bye-bye.